Hi guys and assalamu alaikum welcome to my new blog post blog post 3 and in this blog post i'm going to discuss about the power bi desktop uh, this vlog is actually related to like giving you a, a brief overview about the power bi desktop like uh, how much easiness is actually provided by the power bi desktop the tool so let's start when we talk about power bi so it means like you can actually connect to your data with very ease like wherever actually it is present uh, either is on the cloud or the on premises you can actually connect uh, connect to your data power bi actually provide you with the easiness to connect to your data so uh, next one is like you can actually prepare and model your data with like with small uh, within small of uh, small amount of time you can actually easily do that so you really don't need to be very technical about it another thing another feature is like the power bi basically provide you advanced analytics and if you know the office then it will be a very huge plus in your advanced analytics journey and the next one is basically the data insights that are actually provided by the power bi desktop feature so it's 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 helped you to explore Uh, various various kind of analytics that are actually provided by the power bi then you can actually create very interactive reports with uh, with the features that are uh, that are actually provided by the power bi desktop so uh, once you will actually create these uh, insights reports and the analytics with this, uh, with the help of like power bi desktop you can actually authorize everyone uh, to utilize that report or the end result of the of the work that you have done so you can actually uh, like uh, share it with everyone so let's uh, discuss more about these one by one when we i talk about connect to your data it means like access you can actually access the data from hundreds hundreds of supported on premises and cloud 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 based resources sources such as for example Dynamics 365. If you are, if you have Salesforce, you can connect to that. Azure SQL da- database, uh, Excel, SharePoint, Bet, uh, Vana, SurveyMonkey, SiteImprove, QuickBase, uh, or you can actually provide a blank query uh, to your SQL Server, and you can actually get the data. So it will always ensures that it's always up to date with your with automated and incremental refreshes. Power BI Desktop basically enables you to develop deep, actionable insights for a broad range of scenarios. So the next one is preparation and model your data with ease. So it will actually save a lot of your time and make data prepare easy with the data modeling tools. Uh, so you can actually reclaim hours in your way, your day using the self-service Power BI query experience. Uh, if you're if you're familiar to millions of excel users ingest transform integrate and enrich the data in the power bi so next one is basically advanced analytics and power bi desktop basically provide advanced analytics and if you're familiar with the office it's a huge plus uh, you can actually dig deeper into data and find patterns that you may have otherwise missed that led to actionable insights use features like quick measures grouping forecasting and clustering and give advanced users full control over the over their model using powerful dax formula language and we will have a full course about the dax formula language in our future blog series so if you are familiar with the office you will feel like it's at home in the power bi so the next one is data insights and when i talk about the data insights it means data insights with ai driven augmented augmented analytics so with power bi desktop you can actually explore your data automatically find patterns understand what your data means and predict future outcomes to drive business results the new ai capabilities pioneered in azure and now available in the power bi required no code enabling all of your power bi users to discover hidden actionable insights and drive more strategic business outcomes so if you know about the azure ai 
you can actually uh, you can actually use Power BI Desktop and collaborate them both, and you will have very good results uh, with uh, with respect to your data. So next one is like uh, you can actually create interactive reports uh, and customize them for your business. Create stunning reports with interactive data visualizations and Power BI Desktop then tells you a story, data story, that how you can actually do that this with using only drag and drop, dropping the canvas and how you can actually do like create uh, hundreds of modern data visuals from Microsoft and partners or create your own. Using the Power BI open source custom visuals framework, you can actually design your report with theming, formatting and layout tools. So you can do a lot and you can actually create very inter interactive reports. Last one is like author for everyone and anywhere. So you can actually get visual analytics to, pe to the people who actually need that. You can actually create mobile optimized reports for viewers to consume on the go. So you can publish from Power BI Desktop to the cloud or on-premises, embed reports created in Power BI Desktop into existing apps or website. So this is all about Power BI Desktop.